So the goal of this part of the project is to paint the foam pieces and to do so I needed to assemble a little PVC like stand to paint them on so they wouldn't touch the ground and it would be easier to paint this way so they're floating in the air. Right now I'm painting with Plasti Dip. It's like spray on plastic that kind of seals the foam because the foam really likes to soak up paint. I should have done a second coat of the Plasti Dip because you can't really see it in the video but up close, you could see all of the pores just absolutely sucked up this white. Even though after this clip, I went ahead and did a second and third coat of the white. Now I'm back inside. I printed this out from the internet uh, because Google has everything you could ever want. What I'm painting on is the Jedi Order symbol that goes on Obi-Wan Kenobi's shoulder armor. And I think this is one of the most iconic pieces of his actual armor and his costume, so I really wanted to make sure I got it right. Before any of you ask, yes, I'm going over a second and third time to make sure that all of these things I'm painting are really good. As you can see, I'm a master of doing everything off the screen because I can't really get my iPhone to focus properly. It's weird. I don't know. Right now, uh, what am I doing? I am aging it and giving it some battle wounds and battle scars. I feel like singing Taylor Swift now, but I shouldn't. But I'm basically aging it. I'm making it look not like clean, crisp armor, but more like it's been through a battle. It's seen things. The droids have taken their toll on it. Now, this is where I messed up. I'm leaving this clip in to show you guys that I do mess up. Cosplay is all about messing up. You just have to learn from it. The paracord I cut was way too short. So now I have another beer and I have some white paracord that I bought. I bought way more than I needed and I'm going ahead and just threading it. This is how I actually attach it to my body. I basically cinch it up like a shoelace and huzzah. This is the final product of the armor portion, I guess. I have a few more pieces to get. I have some trimming of the little dangly strings to do, but overall I think it looks awesome. Uh, now I'm a bit worried because I have to figure out how to do sewing and how to make his little robe, the Jedi robes. So that'll be fun. You can check that out in part three, which will be here sometime in the future. Thanks for watching.